Okay, and we're back after that shopping spree. So, let's go to the Himalayas. Pack my parka, Duckworth. We're headed for the Himalayas to hunt for the lost crown of Genghis Khan. Shall I forward your call, sir? Gee, can I come, Uncle Scrooge? I want to see the pretty Himalayan marmots. Oh, not this time, Wibby darling. I need you here looking after the boys. Otherwise, who knows what kind of trouble they might get into. Oh, that's very smart. Uncle Scrooge! Indulge me, lads. The last thing this expedition needs is a wee lass about. Oh, I'm going to have enough trouble looking after the launch pad. Woo! Da -da -da danger, watch behind you. There's a stranger out to find you. Yeah. The mighty ducks. Fuck Anaheim. <laughs> Launch pad. I told you to land in the center of the mountain range, not in the center of a mountain. Gee, Mr. McTee, I thought that crash was rock solid. The only rocks around here are the ones inside your head. Ugh, oh, we're nowhere near Shadow Pass and the Lost Crown. Now fix this wreck so we can get airborne. And step on it, lad. I'm paying you by the hour, and I'll may have you billing me for overtime. No problem, boss. As long as I have this fuel regulator, we're as good as... Whoopsie-daisy. Oops. You dumbass. <laughs> Uh, my mom always said I was a Butterfingers. <laughs> oh, no. Please tell me you've got another one of those. Sure I do. <laughs> but it's back in Duckburg. Launch pad! Don't worry, Mr. McDee. I'll climb down and get it. You'll do no such thing. I'll get it. You stay here and try not to cause any more damage. Okay. You're the boss. Ah, oh, Webby, you freaking dumb bitch. Uh, now comes, in my opinion, the hardest part of the game for me. I, at least for me, this was the hardest part. It's the freaking goats, man. You stooped. They beat the shit out of me. They were relentless. Not today. Today we're gonna keep digging our damn asses. Well, maybe not right away. Eventually. Oh, fuck, you see? You can't pogo jump all the time. Um, you know what? This time I think we'll. Oh, fuck, you see? Fuck off! Fucking eat you guys. Ah! Not you. See, you can't deal with this bullshit. I hate them. I hate him. I hate them. Holy shit! Fuck yourself. <laughs> I hate the goats. I hate them so much. Thank God. <laughs> Let's deal with it bullshit. Yeah, that's it. What about there? No. Oh, that was a close one. Yeah, oh no you don't. Stupid rabbits with that. Here now, don't touch that. <laughs> I need it to fix my plane. Stop! You think they'd oh, listen it's to you? Too late. Those bunny bandits have torn it apart. I've got to find those pieces fast. I do also like how they got uh, the original voice actors from the cartoon. Even though me and our friend, like, not, well, not too recently, but a while ago, tried to rewatch DuckTales. We thought we loved it, but then. Going back to it, those Huey, Dewey, and Louis, they have voices. Uh, make sure. Okay.
can't remember which way is the right way to go. Let's see, which jog is my memory? Uh, I think I preferred going the other way. So we'll do this one. Yeah, I, I, I do like Scrooge's voice and all that, but I could like listen to like a whole episode based on uh, Huey, Dewey, and Louie's voices. It, it, it got old fast. <laughs> you know, it's one of those things where nostalgia really kicks in. <laughs> like, ah, uh, that wasn't that good, was it? Like, not, not that I can remember. <laughs> Glory! <laughs> now to find the other two pieces. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I just go this way, avoiding everything? See, like, what's the point of? Wait. Uh, I thought maybe like I could like just destroy that. No, pointless. All for not. I'll wait. Jump on. Go down again, bitch. Come on, skate at me, mighty ducks. <laughs> Didn't think so. Uh, rather you. <laughs> um, at night. I think here I want to go down. Okay, so this is. Where I can't quite remember. Okay, yeah. Way too close. Jump. Jump. Is it you that has it? No, I think it's this next one. And it over. It's the second piece of the fuel regulator. One more piece to find and we can get out of this overgrown ice box. Yeah, we'll see what we got here. Oh, another heart. That counts as a hit? That extra money. Um, which way was easier? I'll just go this. Cause I can. Yeah, that's death, I'm pretty sure. Okay, I'll just re-go this way. Yeah, because before I would just, once I got it, I would just turn around, so I didn't, couldn't really remember what was the other way, so. Thought I'd see what was up. Plus, feel a lot more safer going this way than did the other way. Though with the icicles I could fall and I don't want to lose a life because knowing my luck on this level I'd probably die on it. Batter up, even though I prefer hockey over baseball. Though I did play baseball for like seven years and I never really played hockey unfortunately. Bunch of Come on. Not shifting. See, that's why I wanted to knock out the spider. I mean, not the spider, the fucking rabbit. I would just suck a dick. Oof. Oof, that was way too close. I come. Did I go the wrong way? I did. Yeah, I did. I did. I just remembered. God damn it. <laughs> oh, I'm so stupid. Uh, how the hell am I supposed to? Whew. That looks pretty good. Not to uh, brag or anything, but I'm really impressed myself on that one. 
we got? We go down here. We gotta go left as well. Okay, I'm trying to get the ramp treasure that I didn't get before. Oh, I can, oh, I can bounce him. Oh, whatever. Bam, bam! It's Bubba Duck. Looks like that poor little pea brain got caught in a deep freeze. I wonder where the extra life is on this one. Because I know I'm like 90% sure it's on everyone. Oh, what happened? Scooge? Ooga, ooga! Scooge saved Baba! There, there, little fella. Uncle Scrooge is here to help. Scooge saved Baba! Scooge saved Baba! Scooge saved Baba! Baba helps Scooge! Baba helps Scooge forever! <laughs> you know, I could use a bit of help smashing away this giant ice box. What do you say, Bubba? Ooga, ooga! In that case, follow me, lad! I'm just trying to think where it would be. Like, I might have missed it in one of those places, but... Waka, waka, it's a treasure! I don't really know. Okay, let's... whack them all Oh, yes. I remember when I first did this, he took for he sure did take his freaking time. Oh shit, I'm not gonna make it. Oh I fuck you. Oh, for that? Come on. Come on. This one. Beautiful. Don't take care of that. Wow. Two for two. Yeah, come on, you're so close. There you go. Beautiful. Oh. Oh, I guess there's no point. This is the end of the line, Bubba. It's time for you to head to the surface. Bubba home with Scrooge? Aye. Launch pad is waiting to take you home to Duckburg. On your way now. Every thousand counts. <laughs> I guess I must have missed it some. Fuck. Must have missed it somewhere. But whatever. This isn't a uh, guide or anything, even though. Oh. Yeah, there you go. Oh, look at the ducks! The last one. Now to get this fuel regulator back to launch pad. This isn't like a guide or anything like that, but even though I, it's gonna, it's gonna bug me if I find it on every other level except this one. I don't remember finding it. Disappointing to say the least. It's like I thought I even explored the whole map too. Could go left, but who knows? I don't really care. As long as I beat this level. <laughs> Oh, that was... That was not that was stupid. Damn it! We need that. What happens if we... I don't feel like finding out. Like, honestly, that's probably the way. That's one of those things. Is it really worth it? Oh, come on, that. So be a secret. Oh, I think I have one last encounter with fucking goats. No, oh, Jesus. Ugh. I'm gonna break all this. No, you wanna fuck off there, Mr. Goat? Honestly, it's the toughest part for me. I hate them. <laughs> uh, whatever. I'm 
see what the point of that is. You don't even head back that way. Here you go, launch pad. Good as new. Now get this bucket of bolts back in the sky. Just a tick, Mr. McD. If this ought to do it. Now there's your problem. Webbergill, what in the world are you doing here? I wanted to see the pretty crown, Uncle Scrooge. Oh, great. Now I've got to babysit you and Launchpad. But I can help, Uncle Scrooge. You're not like the boys, are you? You don't think I'm just a worthless tag-along, do you? Yeah. We're ready for liftoff, Mr. McD. Ah, not a moment too soon. Stop in tight, Webby dear. Maybe a tiny bit of a worthless take along. Nothing but blue skies ahead. Clear as a bell. Not a cloud in sight. Launch pad. Knock off that infernal chatter. Gee whiz. I was only trying to lighten the mood. If anything, we need to lighten the plane. Feels like she's lost maneuverability with all the uh, unexpected cargo we seem to have picked up. No worries, Mr. McD. I've got the coordinates for Shadow Pass locked in. We'll be there lickety-split. More like lickety-splat. Glomgold. Nice to see you, McDuck. Especially since you've led me right to the treasure. To whom do I owe my thanks? Your idiotic pilot. Or did you play it safe and let those two V1s fly the plane? You dusty cheat. Only you could sink so low. And at 15,000 feet, no less. Complain all you like. The lost crown of Genghis Khan will look right at home on my feathered noggin. Wouldn't you say, Scroogey? <laughs> That's what you think. You'll never beat us to Shadow Pass. So, the crown is in Shadow Pass, eh? Thanks for telling me. <laughs> Launch pad. Oh god, do it on myself, I suppose. Better up. Is that a bomb? On, Get out of here. You underestimate me, boy. Shut up, asshole. You can only use catchphrases if you're actually hitting me. Then I'll allow it. He's catching up. Come on, one more. Oh shit. Let's go ahead. Yeah. Oh. You Home run. The last of me, Team Rocket's yeah, blasting off again. Try it the other way around, and I couldn't agree more, Webby. Pickle me, pin feathers. There it is. Shadow pass directly ahead. Take us down, launch pad. Slow and steady this time. No problem, old Mr. McD. We're close to that treasure now. I can almost smell it. <sighs> Wasn't me. <laughs> That definitely wasn't me. Whatever it is, it won't last long if it tries to get between me and the lost crown. Uncle Scrooge, don't go. Dinner not worry, lassie. Whatever is in that cave is no match for your Uncle Scrooge. I earn my fortune by being smarter than the smarties and tougher than the toughies. If anything's in there, it had better step aside. But I'm scared. Stay with Launchpad. He'll take good care of you. Like, shut up, kid. <laughs> oh, wow, that actually worked. Accidentally, of course, but. Okay, I'm just gonna go with the. Oh. Does he jump down here? Oh, good. Huh, <laughs> commit suicide. Yay. 
sure we're not missing anything before the boss fight. Oh, beautiful. Uh, let's see if I can remember. Okay, I'd have to jump onto this guy. Oh, just by the hair of me, chinny chin chin. I don't know why they're not always on target, though. They never put on the right corner. Maybe that's me not paying attention. Woo! I am barely making these. Ah, fuck. Oh, that was lucky. Huh. Is he gonna come the other way? Oh, good. <laughs> Makes that a lot easier. Oh, damn it. I actually have to wait for him to get there. Okay. The more you know. Oh, I thought that was going to be off. Get there. Okay. One's closer. That doesn't make. Ah, oh, whatever. Ah! Oh. I almost fell for that. That was easy. Okay. Come Yo! Come on. Is that it? What you got, boy? Went the wrong way, dumbass. Yeah, this game is a lot easier once you just get the basic mechanics down. Like, play through it the first time. After that, it's so easy. This monster tried to pummel me. Why, I nearly cashed my last check. Oh, I know, ma'am. But Uncle Scrooge is really nice once you get to know him. Webby, you understand this creature? Of course, Uncle Scrooge. It's all in a Junior Woodchuck guidebook. What's she saying now? She says she's sorry if she hurt you. She's just upset because she stepped on a thorn and can't get it out. A thorn? <gasps> you don't suppose... Here's your thorn, Webigail. <laughs> the lost crown of Genghis Khan. The pretty crown. <laughs> you found it. Hey, the poor creature was standing on it. Webby, I cannot thank you enough. I hope you can find it in your heart to forgive me. Without your help, we never would have found the treasure. Oh, uh, and thanks to you too, ma'am. <laughs> I think she likes you, Uncle Scrooge. Well, that's odd. Usually it's me the ladies go gaga for. Hey, uh, well, let's get home before she grows any fonder of me. Stage cleared. <laughs> I'm surprised I was actually able to beat that. That one was a huge pain in my ass the first time. Ugh. Only... One more with five stages to go. The moon. The lost crown of Genghis Khan is mine, lads. <laughs> All it took was a bit of tenacity and perseverance. And a little kindness and patience. Right, Uncle Scrooge? Right you are, Webby darling. Now, 
Where's Bubba run off to? Yeah, where is he? He was here a minute ago. Why does no answer Bubba? He's over there having a tea party with Webby's toys. No, Bubba Smash! Uh-oh, Webby. Sounds like Bubba's not getting along so good with your Quacky Patch dolls. <gasps> you keep away from my dolls, mister! Uh, remember, kindness and patience, Webbygill. Set a good example for the lad. Well then, what treasure shall we look for next? Well, we only got one option. <laughs>